Hello everyone. Now we start the week six. The second story, the pearl written in 1947, telling you about the three nationalities, one Indian, Mexican, Mexican and Spanish Mexican. The older country is Mexican. But you can see 400 years ago, the, the Spans came to Mexico and they became richer and richer. But the Red Indian, or we can say Indian Mexican, got poorer and poorer. And now, if you see the main character. In the second story, the pearl. One Kino. Who is Kino? Kino is a pearl hunter, or can say he works as a pearl dower. He is so hard working. Honorable, but is much superstitious. And his wife, Juna, she is so skillful and flexible. Happy king and loves about to her family. And number three, Koyotito is Kino Juna one only son. He's stung by a scorpion while resting in a hammer. At the end of the story, Koyotito is killed by the tracker at the kales. Sorry, it's in the caves at the mountain. And it's Juna, Juna Thomas, is Kino older brother, deeply loyal to Kino family. He lets Kino stay in his house for one night before going to sell her in another location. Apollonia is June Thomas Y and the mother of four children. They have four children, like her father. She is sympathetic to Kino and Juna dilemma. Number six, the doctor. Doctor is Spanish, or we can call Spanish Mexican. He rich, but he least he is money minded. He love to cure the patient who's rich, either Mexican, Spanish, Spanish or Red Indian. Number seven, the local villager priest. Here, he came to Kino house and told Kino to share his love with the God. And number eight, the deal, the dealers, I mean the pearl buyer. They are extremely well organized and corrupt pearl dealers in La Paz. But you can see in the La Paz how much Kino wanted to sell his pearl to the dealer. He, uh, it cost 
500,000 peso. 500 peso. But the deal, the dealer guess he knows only 150 peso. That's why you know he didn't sell his pearl and he brought his pearl to sell at Lorento, or we can call Santa Rosalia, Rosalia. But his selling is not successful because his cogito is killed by the tracker as to end up you know, throw the pearl into the sea. And number nine, the trackers are the group of violent men that follow Kino and Tuna. Who let them follow the pearl dealers? And you can see another shift from the doctor, from the dealers or Kino neighbors who were jealous of Kino getting the world, the pearl of the world, or a giant world, the giant pearl. But his pearl turned useless. According to the dealer, told Kino that his pearl was the ugly one because it is too, uh, too big. That's why they gave you, you know, only 150, 150, 150 pesos. Welcome to chapter one. Chapter one, open your books on page on page one, everyone. But please read the introduction of the story, the, the pearl. You can get my information from the pearl written in 1947. Question number one, how does the story begin? You see, on page one, it tells you a poor couple living in a small hut with one baby. Husband get Husband getting up early morning, listen to the song of the birds, and does exercise. But his wife is busy to make the breakfast for the family and rock the baby in the hammock by her. Question number two, what purpose do you think the author in the way he start the story? You can get the points, everyone. You see, in my handout and get more information from the cost book. And what purpose do you think the author in a way he start the story? Here. The author want to stop believing in the superstition because you can see there are two songs, a family song and the evil song. The songs 
refer to the superstition in which the people, or I can say the red Indian people believe in. The family song is a good song, a lucky song, a happiness, the song of the happiness. But the evil song is a harmful one in which anyone or the rest of the family get any get any harm or danger in any way. Another purpose the author want to eliminate the discrimination or the prejudice or the raci rac uh, racism between human beings such as red Mexican, Spanish, Spanish Mexican and Mexican. Question number three, describe the living condition of Kino family. Kino lives in the small hand with poor living condition. He has a small boat for finding the pearl for making a living. The boat was given by his grandfather. Number four, list the morning activity involved with Vikino and Tuna. I have told you in the how the story begins. Kino gets up early morning, does exercise and listen to the song sung by the birds around his house. And Tuna makes the breakfast and rocks the baby by her. Number five, according to the story, what do you think the word song refer to? I have told you there are two songs. The songs refer to the superstition in which the people believe in. And number six, describe the different reaction of Kino and Juna to the scorpion down to the baby boss moment. You can see on page on page three, Kogitito is sleeping in the hammocks. But unluckily, the scorpion crawls down to the earth, the scorpion didn't want, or we can say it doesn't want to buy the cogitito, but because of Kino, seeing that Kino wanted to kill the scorpion, he jumped to catch the scorpion, but he missed. That's why the scorpion dropped on the cogitito and beat the cogitito. And how about Juna? She was calm and prays for the lux for her baby. Question number seven. How would you characterize Kino and Juna. You see, Kino is aggressive, bad temper, hot, headed, and Juna calm, quiet, patient, and in chapter one, she's so skillful. Number eight, what is the neighbor respond to Juna calling for a doctor? 
the people living in the village told you that the doctor doesn't come to the small huts, especially in the Indian community, because we are poor, the people said. Number nine, describe the outlook you know, and his people have for the doctor and vice versa. The doctor doesn't come to cure a poor baby, a baby who lived in a poor living condition, especially a red Mexican, a red Indian Mexican. But the doctor will cure any patient who is rich, either Mexican or Indian or Spanish. He's money minded. He did he did he doesn't care the human being. Number 10, did the doctor agree to cure Coyodito? Why and why not? The doctor told his servant that I am not at home. Please tell them. Why? Because the four region Coyodito is a poor West Indian and Coyodito has only a few ugly per here the Based on chapter one, compare characterize of Gino and Doctor. You can see characteristic of Gino and Doctor how his bad temper. He hits the door of the doctor bleeding. Why? Because he got angry with the doctor who refused to cure his son Guyrito. How about doctor? Money minded and kind. He's gone full and inhuman or rest, resort, the resort. Number five, in your opinion, what message is stayed back trying to communicate in this contrast between doctor and the Indian? The author wanted to reconcile any human being stop discriminate against the human being then be money minded then exploit each other or do not discriminate against racism in chapter, 12, in chapter 2, I'm sorry. Question number one. What would be a suitable title or a heading for chapter 2? You can see chapter 2 has its own title. Kino finds the great pearl. And what is your own title? Please tell me, anyone. What is your own title? To suit, it is suitable or for the chapter two. Please tell me in the Zoom meeting, everyone. And question number two, what was the old thing of value which Kino owned before he found the pearl and why was it valuable? Only Kano, it a canoe, it's a kind of boat. It 
twice similar to the boat. Who gave him his grandfather? And why it was so valuable? Kino could not make money without Kano. It made Kino so wise his family. It made Kino earn much money from it. Number two, number three, sorry. Who handled the boat Kino or Tuna? You can see uh, in chapter two, who, right? It is either, either Juna or Kino. They work a good hand with each other. But Kino pushed the boat into the deep her water. And number four, how are the pearls forms in oyster? You can see on page seven, paragraph one. The pearl math out oh. sand collected in the oyster. The longer the sand stays in the oyster, the bigger the pearl is. That's why Kino found only the big uh, oyster and broke it. Finally, he got the pearl, the world of the pearl, or a giant pearl, the great pearl. Number five, while Kino was starving for pearl, what was Juna doing? Juna picking up the sea plant to apply on the Koyotito wound. And another action, she prays for a good luck, for a good luck for her husband to get safe and sound and get the big pearl for Koyotito. And number six, How long could Kino remain under the water in a doubt? You can see in on page seven, the last paragraph. It is two minutes. And how about you? How could you stay in uh, in the water? One minute, two minutes, or a half minute? Please tell me, everyone. And number seven, it is good to want something too much. If something does drive the, uh, the lust away, are there any similar spirits in Cambodian culture, in Khmer culture? What thing might cause bad luck? Yeah, if you need something too much, it will dry, it will go away from you. Why? It's because you are ambitious. That's why when you pray, you should get only one. Do not get many. Right. Number eight, what more do we learn about character of Kino and Juna from their action in chapter two. Yes, in chapter two, Kino is patient. Kino is devoted. Kino is hardworking. Or he could not get the great pearl. And how about Juna? She's skillful. She is a bit superstitious. 
or I can say she's down to us. Why I say she's skillful, right? She can use the sea plant to apply on cogitito wound. The sea plant could absorb the venom of the scorpion in cogitito wound. Please tell me more about that, everyone. Number nine, in your opinion, how would Kino plan his life after discovery of the pearl? I think what Kino did is for his son Koyudito. He wished Koyudito healthy. Uh, the first plan, I think, he will send Kujirito to cure in the doctor's house. I don't tell you much more about Kino Wish in another chapter, but here's my opinion. He may build a new house, he may buy a new boat, he may share some luck to the God. Or he may buy a good closet for his wife. Thank you very much, everyone. I just tell you some information written in the course book. Please read much more. This week, you have the test covering chapter one, chapter two of the pearl. You do not hold the test for the